Hey there, guys. We're going to do the Earthbound Oracle. How are you guys doing? Thank you so much for subscribing and liking and following your own intuition. I love reading your comments. Let's see what comes up. We have guide and a compass. I, I'm getting a hit that um, you're kind of not sure which direction to take. Obviously, we have a compass here. We have a light here. So for some of you, this will be about your specific purpose. You're getting called to something, but you're just you're feeling lost in navigation and with this um i forget the name of that tool where where you ask yes or no questions it's very still telling me that you don't know whether it's a yes whether it's a no so we get a feeling of a feeling lost or confused deceit okay you feel very confused there's deceit on the table so obviously for some of you you feel like you can't trust yourself for others you're dealing with people who are deceitful so let's see voice uh-huh so for some of you this is asking you to ask for help because we have the cosmos we have the crown chakra we have uh, the wolf who's very connected to his pack. So it's almost asking you to connect to the crown, the divine. Ask, speak your truth, begin to, begin to, um, be authentic, uh, in, in the way you speak. I, for some of you, I'm getting that you're already there. You have almost shifted in your speaking the truth of who you are. I'm seeing even the wolf here with his uh, its eyes closed. It's almost like you're speaking your truth of who you are. Um, very spiritual person. And so... That's what I'm getting here. Let's see if there's anything else. Let's let's ask about this deceit. What is that about? Vision in reverse. So yeah, it's like I'm getting several hits. So for some of you, you were working with people and it it just wasn't aligned with you. You it felt off. It felt deceitful. It, felt like they were not speaking their truth your vision got cloudy and again we have purple here with the crown chakra so this is telling me your third eye your intuition and inner wisdom got a little cloudy because of that okay um so sorry you're you're dealing with that let's see if there's anything else this is all confirming when you feel, when you intuitively know that a reading is for you and you feel it, this is a confirmation. We're, we're all connected, you guys. We're all connected. Balance. It's asking you for balance. Know that you're protected. Look, guys, <laughs> tell me this is not synchronized. So we have the the pine cone, which is connected to the pineal gland, you're protected with all the wings here and the, um, I'm seeing that there needs to be balance in your, in you trusting yourself, trusting what you're feeling, trusting your wisdom. Trusting your, we have some crown chakra here with the pineal gland and trust what it is that you're channeling, that you're perceiving. Trust that, okay, is what I'm getting and, and bring balance into it. So for example, if, if this is going to be very specific, if you're a very spiritual person 
and you are um, questioning what you're feeling or what you might be feeling specifically spiritually. Um, let's say you're a tarot reader, for example, and um, you're not sure, like there's a lack of focus or you're, you're questioning your vision. This balance is remove yourself from the situation. Do you see how the wolf is not even thinking? They're just kind of allowing this energy to speak through them. There's no ego. There's no nothing attached. They're not attached to the results. Their eyes are closed. They're just kind of in the moment, very focused. You know, that's going to bring you a sense of balance a sense of grounding and then you're going to begin to to see because when you don't have an agenda and you just ask you know to to do what you love and you just ask for direction and then you express that into the world you're going to begin to be able to distinguish what is this feeling to what is this they feel very different so you're going to be able to tell what feels aligned with you what is you what is the light versus what feels like tricky or fearful okay so i hope this was helpful and um, let me know in the comments and i will see you in the next reading bye guys